So hello everyone, sorry for waiting, but uh, anyway, I'm really happy to meet with you all online. Uh, I am Shuang Huang from Building Smart China Chapter, and today I will introduce you about China Chapter and uh, provide an update on our recent works. So firstly, about who we are and uh, when we was established. Building Smart China was founded in 2013, we are already 11 years old. And Building Smart China is not a registered company or legal entity. We belong to China Institute of Building Standard Design and Research, and we rely on CBS for legal and financial operations and support. CBS is a leading state-owned enterprise majored in development of China's national and industry standards for the AEC sector. And CBS is also the mayoral committee of ISO TC59 and ISO TC10 SA8. And uh, here are our key personnel from BSC. So currently we have five main staffs, all of work, uh, all of us are work part-time for BSC. And uh, one you might be most familiar with uh, Lai Wei and me because we participate more frequently in BSI's activities. And uh, Mr. He Wei on right-hand side is our newly hired training director this year. And he is taking over the role previously held by Suyun. And uh, BIC's vision is to establish a platform for beam communication and promote the research and the application of open beam in China. And to achieve this vision and in alignment with Building Smart's activities, BIC currently has four main areas of working focus. So the first one is um, standard development and research. On one hand, we study and promote the Building Smart Open Beam Standard System. And on the other hand, we are now carrying out localization for Open Beam, primarily IFC at the moment. Of course, the localization of IFC is conducted under the technical guidance of BSI. Uh, and I will introduce about this point more later. And the second one is beam training. Um, and this mainly refers to our involvement in the Building Smarts Professional Certification Program. And we participated in the weekly meeting of the PCERT Technical Committee. And we are also constantly seeking new providers and the project operation models to enhance the program's perf uh, performance in China. And the third one is BIM certification. And this work has always been a very important task for BSC. As early as in um, 2018, uh, LiveA uh, initiated the China BIM Certification Alliance, and uh, we conducted the first batch of China um, BIM project certifications. And now BSC has also initiated and uh, participated in the BSI project, uh, project and the enterprise certification programs. And uh, the last one is international cooperation and exchange. We actively, uh, actively participated in BSI summits and working groups. And we also selecting and encourage capable Chinese enterprise to join in B uh, Building Smart International as the Building Smart International's member. And uh, in terms of the Building Smart uh, standards participation, as you can see, CCCC, CRBM, Civil Aviation, University of China, and the newly joined GAA, which is short for Guangdong Airport Authority, uh, they are all Building Smart China's member, and uh, part of them are BSI's member. And uh, we have been committed to development and promote of the IFC and uh, other open beam standards and service in China. Uh, and uh, since 2022, uh, Building Smart China has been organizing members and industry companies to study IFC and uh, we gather the extension needs based on the translation of IFC. Uh, so this initiative originated from Building Smart's efforts to organize the translation of IFC into various languages. Uh, and in response, BIC encouraged our members to participate in the translation work. However, during this process, we, reali uh, we realized that uh, only translation was not enough. 
because IFC as an international standard cannot fully meet the regional and local requirements. Uh, and our ultimate goal is to use IFC standards. And throughout the whole working process, China Chapter has maintained communication with Building Smart International, and we are aware of the CC license agreement for IFC. So therefore, this work will, will gradually transition towards BSDD. But what we have done can become an important foundation for uh, Chinese companies to understand and uh, for them to use uh, the BSDD. And here is what we have done. We have initiated the work of translating and extension of IFC into nine Chinese industrial standards under the official association in China. However, these Chinese standards will only include some basic framework content and the complete translated version of the IFC will be stored on a platform or on a website as an open industry resource. And once completed, it will also be submitted to Building Smart International as the official IFC Chinese version. Yes. Um, and uh, as you can see, this is uh, what we have done. So for the translation work, we have uh, translated 9,000 and... Oh, sorry, this video, this video has the sound. So, okay, I just uh, pause, pause it. Oh, oops, okay. <laughs> Sorry, this video has a sound. So, um, yeah, oh, cannot. Um, yeah, so uh, in terms of the PCERT, so in this year, we have organized the one PCERT training and we issued 146 certificates and uh, we have issued 600 certificates in total. Uh, and uh, we also, uh, uh, BSC initiated the PNE cert, which is for the project and enterprise certification. And now this project is uh, set as one of the Building Smart strategic project and is now inviting companies and uh, uh, yeah, individuals from all over, the, uh, all over the world to join in. So if you are interested in this project, you can just connect uh, Lightway for more information. And in terms of the BSI awards, since 2018, we have been promoting this awards program in China, uh, and we're hosting a lot of open beam seminars and organize events to invite winners to give uh, presentations to share their um, use case and the best practices. So this effort has successfully enhanced the uh, companies in China to understand of the open beam and open beam tools and solutions. And every year, we also invited um, experts from China to, uh, to participate in the judging process. And this year, we invited 15 experts to judge the project. And uh, we are very happy to see that 11 projects from China mainland and 11 projects from China Hong Kong submitted their um, outstanding project to the BSA Awards program. Um, and uh, in order to promote and let more people know OpenBeam, we have a lot of activities both online and offline. And uh, we ask Mark to translate his short videos about OpenBeam into China. And these short videos are very popular and well uh, and uh, useful for us to understand OpenBeam. And uh, we think that because um, Building Smart now released a lot of new services like IFC validation, uh, IDS check and new standard ideas. So we hope to have more such kind of uh, short videos for us to um, uh, translate and use in our local market. And uh, this year, we also support Building Smart Hong Kong, Hong Kong to, um, uh, to host the, uh, in the International Asia Summit. And uh, we also uh, work um, more and more close with Hong Kong chapter to uh, study and communicate open beam together this year. And in this month, 24, uh, we will have another open beam and open GIS seminar in Shenzhen uh, hold together with uh, Hong Kong chapter. And uh, uh, during uh, the year 2023 and this year, uh, and the Building Smart uh, leaders visited China Chapter and gave us a lot of guidance. So we, China Chapter, welcome Building Smart uh, uh, 
colleagues to visit us again uh, and to learn what the beam is like in China to know the enterprise uh, requirements so that we can uh, work closer together. And uh, what's next? Uh, our working plan is to promote the integration of CNFC with BSDD. And then under the guidance of Building Smart International, we hope to um, further expand our international cooperation, especially uh, uh, cl collaborate closer with Asia chapters like Hong Kong chapter, Japan chapter, Asia chapter, and to uh, hold more uh, exchange seminars. And then we will continue to participate in Building Smart International works and including FC validation, BSDD accelerated program. Uh, and we are going to research on these projects more and involve in these works more. And the last one is as Building Smart China chapter, we need to, um, uh, uh, to attract more companies in China to join a BIC, and we will like select and encourage more uh, capable companies in China to join in Building Smart International's works. Um, and uh, that's all from me. Thank you for listening. And uh, any questions? <laughs> and uh, Mr. Lai Wei is also here. And if uh, anything um, not enough, you can make complimentary to my speech. <laughs>